<laughs> hey guys, welcome back to the Easy Legacy Challenge. As you guys just saw, these guys have just been enjoying a chill little Winterfest morning together. You know they go hard for holidays. Um, but since the kids are getting older and they have little boyfriends and girlfriends, two girlfriends, kind of, in Blanche's case, <laughs> um, they want to have little dates with their significant others. So the family just celebrated early this year and they are pretty much all set to have good holidays now except for Winter who is still glitched out and has no holidays that pop up for her. Did you guys know if you open all the presents it turns into this? I've never seen that. I guess I've never had my sims open enough presents um, from the present pile but yeah that's a thing I guess. <laughs> um, I didn't really pay attention to what gifts they ended up opening. Blanche got a towel ring. That's random. Um, Ivy got a candle. Blanche got a candle. Winter got citrine. <laughs> hey, she actually got a crystal. That's kind of cool. She already had that one, but at least we can trade it at the next flea market. Um, Blanche is going to a rebellious phase. Sure. And then Brooklyn got a yoga mat. Brooklyn made this Winterfest bouquet over here. That was the gift she gave to Ivy. Um, Ivy just gave some random like grow fruit to Brooklyn or something. <laughs> just so I could have the animation of them giving each other gifts. Oh no, Brooklyn's sick. Poor thing. <laughs> of course, I went with a blue theme this year because we are in Glaceon Gen. I think it's time for the teens to go on some dates with their significant others. Oh god. <laughs> so I came to... What? Date complete? What do you mean? I'm pretty sure the the weather just like auto canceled the date. What the heck? Okay. Um, I'm inviting him here. That's annoying. Now does it say they had a, a bad date? You know what? I'm cheating the weather. We don't need to be having a whole blizzard. How about light snow? Thanks. <laughs> I came here because I figured they could ice skate together, which would be cute. Um, I was not anticipating a full on blizzard to be happening though. All right, and they are skating. I still wish, I really, I wish, I wish, I wish that they could do couple skating. Like how cute would that be if they were like holding hands and if they like fell together, like that would just be so cute. <laughs> Oh my god, she's so... She's in her element. <laughs> if there was an ice skating skill, I would want her to be like, maxed out in it. Same with like, skiing and snowboarding. Well, actually, there are skills for those, so I'll probably try... Whoa, girl! I'll probably try to max those out. Let me get a picture. Look at her! I don't even care about Mateo, honestly. <laughs> Queen. Okay. Um, at least the snow chilled out. Thanks, cheats. Um, maybe let's stop skating. Give him the painting she made in the last episode. So Winter worked really hard on this painting for him. You better like it, Mateo. Aww. What do you think? Looks like he liked it at least. So, Mateo, where's Winter's gift? Sir, you guys have been dating throughout, like, pretty much all of high school. They would have been together a couple years at this point, I think. Because, let's see, when do they age up? They're probably starting their senior year, right? So they've been together at least three years, two to three years. And you didn't even get her a Winterfest gift? This is what I mean. She has standards. She is materialistic, <laughs> which sounds bad, but honestly, we can interpret it as her love language is gift giving. And Mateo's just not cutting it. Like he never gets her gifts. He never really puts effort into planning dates. He doesn't really romance her like that. And she's just starting to get kind of tired of it. Give him the cold shoulder. <laughs> she's just starting to realize that she's putting all this effort into their relationship and he's not really doing much so 
Um, let's maybe argue. Not about school. We'll pretend they're arguing about the relationship, okay? <laughs> She's like, really, Mateo? You couldn't even get me, like, a card, flowers? I'm not saying you have to spend a ton of money, but just give me something. And he's like, oh my god, you're so materialistic. He's like, gaslighting her right now, like, trying to make her seem crazy for expecting the bare minimum. Claim Mateo's an alien. Um, no, we are going to insult him. Call him a cheapo, basically. And what else? What else? Yell at him. Oh my god. We're going to throw shade at him. Um, argue about relationship. We're also going to do a petty jab. Oh my god, oh my god. She is pissed. I think she's just kind of been holding it in um, over the years. What is this? What is it? Arguing. What are you mad about this time? We never woohoo anymore. I have needs. <laughs> We've turned into the boring couple. You've been spending way too much simoleons. Or I want to break up. Um, let's just say I want to break up. Screw it. She's over it. Oh my god, look at her! <laughs> the Ice Queen! Do not get on her bad side. Yes, tell him, girl. Oh my god. She's like, you have never appreciated me. You never put in effort. You don't know how lucky you are to have me. Other dudes at school flirt with me all the time. And I could have them. But I stay loyal to you. But what do you do? You don't give me anything. <laughs> are they broken up? Single soon? Oh, okay. So they're not officially broken up. Choose violence? <laughs> That's a little too much. She's not going to do that. We don't need to physically attack him. So let's chew him out. Denounce their friendship. She's like, oh, and by the way, no, we can't stay friends. So don't even think about asking that. Then I guess we'll just break up. Stop trying to talk casual. We are not going to stay friends. Don't talk to me in school. Don't talk to me in the art club. Matter of fact, why don't you leave the art club? Because your art sucks. <laughs> okay. Looks like they are officially breaking up. Oh my god. <laughs> Look at his face. <laughs> what a winter fest, huh? Okay, so... Let's see what it says here now. Bad romance. Broken up. She's deeply wounded. He's bitter about the breakup. That kind of, that tracks. All right, so she's done with him. Her little Frozen, male Elsa from Frozen relationship did not work out. But he's looking freaking happy about it. What the hell? He's like, I'm free. <laughs> we gotta have Blanche deal with his dramatic a romance situation. Blanche is taking a steamy shower, getting ready to invite over Alyssa. It's super, I mean, Connie. Oh my god, I can't even keep them straight. <laughs> His official girlfriend, Connie. Meanwhile, Winter's in here channeling her sadness into a sad painting. She's now inspired. Good job, girl. You don't need to cry over that loser, Mateo. He was not good enough for you. Blanche actually got this random crochet or knitted penguin thing <laughs> off of Plopsy for um, Connie. I actually think she would like it because she's kind of a geek. I think she would like cutesy little things like that. So he ended up getting that for her. Okay, so we are going to give her that gift. I like how he wrapped it kind of dark. I feel like that's a, a color she would. Oh, she didn't like it. Oh my god. <laughs> Guess he doesn't know her very well or he hasn't been paying attention. I guess she's just disappointed. Maybe she's expecting something else. A steamy kiss? Even though she didn't like her gift. Let's see how this one looks. I've only done one of the, the kisses so far. Aww. 
That one is so cute. Okay. Then he's gonna mess around in the shower with her. <laughs> I really need to just give the teens, um, like, full-size beds. What the? <laughs> oh, look at her painting. <laughs> I'm just gonna sell that. Girl, it's your favorite holiday. Don't let that loser ruin your day. She's gonna come get some random leftover salmon. That's kind of sad. <laughs> well, they had a grand meal. It was just for breakfast. Why is she going around? Why do they keep going around like that? Oh, this is probably in the way, honestly. Oh! Oh no! <laughs> Brooklyn walked in! No, that is so embarrassing. Back arched from kissing. <laughs> what the heck? Okay, um, does she not see this happening or something? She's having no reaction, so yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I think, um, I've been having a lot of glitches with the shower woohoo and like they won't woohoo in the closet. The shower one just like goes into this endless loop and they just never stop, so I have to reset them. Okay then, I'm gonna have them use this bed and we'll just pretend they're doing it in there, okay? <laughs> or else the interaction just won't go through. <gasps> no! <laughs> oh my God. I knew that was gonna happen. Veggie, why? Why? It's always either a party or a holiday. Well, at least the holiday officially ended right as Veggie started to die. Ugh, that is so sad. What if, um, Blizzard dies soon? I don't understand. Veggie lived so long because how is his son Blizzard also an elder already? But he was still alive, like, huh? Girl, you're taking selfies while the dog dies? Can you not? <laughs> the family's distracted. Perfect time to woohoo. <laughs> like, <laughs> Blanche. We're gonna have the Grim Reaper and Santa here in the same night. All right, these guys finally stopped woohooing and came in. He didn't even get a moodlet for the woohoo. I don't know, their woohoo just doesn't seem to be going through. <laughs> All right, Grim, hurry it up. This is a very long and excruciating death for me to witness. Of course, the dog had to die at 3 a.m., which is the exact time my game likes to um, freak out so <laughs> it's taken a little longer worst winterfest ever it's her favorite holiday and she broke up with her boyfriend and then her dog died like <sighs> just the worst <laughs> santa actually never came i had to just reset the grim reaper because he wasn't reaping um this sucks <laughs> r.i.p veggie i'm gonna have winter take a Sleep replacement. Oh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Aw. Bye, Veggie. You were like a very long lived dog. I don't know what happened there. Aw. Look at her trying to make the most of it, even though she's in a terrible mood. <laughs> Just making a little snow angel before she heads off to school. I think I'll play through one more day in this part. And when they get back, um,. We can have her go out for one uh, scavenging session before I end the part, see if we can cheer her up with some new collectibles. <laughs> oh, I think I forgot to mention, but Blanche actually got promoted in chess. He is the captain of the team now, so he's at the highest level, and he got this um, trophy. I wonder if I could put that here, move the Connie picture. <laughs> Ah, shoot, he left, so I can't even access his inventory, so whatever. We'll see that when he gets back. Oh my god, what? <laughs> Winter is acting out, probably because she's in a terrible mood. Apparently, she tried to hack the school computers. Highly doubt she would do that, but maybe secure your computers. Um, let's say that. <laughs> Just because I highly doubt she would try to do that. She's not really, like, a hacker. Like, how would she even be able to do that? Oh my god, now Blizzard's running away. <laughs> Stop! The pets are driving me crazy right now. Ugh. That's just what we need. <laughs> More sadness. So there's this one plant here that's glitching out where 
they just weed it over and over and over and it just doesn't get weeded <laughs> yeah don't know what's up with that it's a rose bush uh-oh looks like brooklyn's starting to get an early midlife crisis she's bored desire for excitement i wonder if we'll get a new um type of midlife crisis because in not so very some of my sims have gotten midlife crises like we had a desire there was one where he wanted to be more creative and there's one where she wanted more adventure um i don't know i still haven't googled about the midlife crisis so i don't know like how many different types you can have i wonder if ivy's having that too it doesn't look like it Oh my gosh, this is actually a really cool, sad painting that Winter's making right now. That's so pretty, Cell. Aw, Vesper just said, missing you, hope you're having a great day. That's very nice, Mom, but actually we're having a terrible day. <laughs> Aw, everybody's so depressed. Ugh, the vibes are not great. <laughs> Blizzard returned, yes! Blizzard. Welcome back. Blanche is gonna welcome him back since that's mainly his dog. I understand you were depressed because your dad died. So I'm not gonna get too mad about you running away. But it was awful timing, I will say that. Aww. Now we gotta give him a bath because he is a mess. Not the first thing Blizzard does when he gets home and starts eating trash. We're gonna lecture him and then give him a freaking bath because he stinks. Gotta have the kids study for their exam they have tomorrow. It'll be their actual final exams, like final final, because it's their last day of school tomorrow. They age up on Saturday. They won't be going to prom again because they already went um, before. So I don't really feel like taking them again, but yeah, tomorrow will be their last day of high school. Yes, that fits perfectly right there. His chess team award. All right, time for a sleep replacement and heading out for <laughs> collecting crystals. <laughs> what else would she do when she's in such a depressed mood? She can't sleep anyway because she's too sad. And... She's like, I might as well just get out of the house. Hopefully it's not blizzarding. I'll go to Oasis Springs that way. Um, we should be good on the whole snow thing. She likes snow, but like, obviously she's gonna walk very slowly if it's blizzarding out. Wait, this is a teen? <laughs> I thought this creepy old man was just talking to her at two in the morning, but it turns out it's a teen who just, I guess, went gray early be really nice if she wasn't so depressed so she could walk faster <laughs> instead she's gonna slowly gloomily walk around digging stuff up um i noticed that things do spawn at 2 a.m but then it's like another round of things spawn in around 5 a.m so that's interesting oh uh, we might not be able to get everything girl hurry up oh no she has to go to school shoot don't really want to let her be late on her last day. Yeah, we have to stop. Ugh, that sucks. Ooh, we got some new crystals. We got a quartz and we got alabaster. I'm just gonna go ahead and take her moodlet solver before she has to head off to school. This poor girl. <laughs> she is on the least natural diet ever. Like, she barely ever eats. She barely takes care of herself. She just takes these artificial supplements all the time to deal with her needs <laughs> good thing is that night of thinking reflecting and scavenging helped her get over her breakup and she's no longer sad so that's good okay we're gonna send them alone yeah the weeds are definitely glitching out because some of the plants it lets me weed and then other ones it just doesn't work <laughs> ah, that's totally fine though because we'll be moving out of this house very soon yeah since our girl is gonna age up in the next episode then she'll have to evolve into glaceon and move the heck out of here <laughs> i think i'm gonna move her to mount komorebi it's probably always been her dream to live there it's a snowy paradise where else would the glaceon gen air live is it realistic that she's always traveling back to the parks and stuff to look for crystals and going to san Mashuno festivals maybe not but you know what 
I also have Pokemon based Sims, so <laughs> I have a plant sim. It's not the most realistic save, right? These weeds. Uh, all right, the exam results are in. Blanche aced it and Winter aced it as we expected. Who kicked our trash over? We're just gifting a bouquet to Nico because we had to do that for her work task. I bet uh, Mateo is the one who came over and knocked over our trash. <laughs> Theo Smiley asked you on a date. No, you can never date anyone else since your mortal husband died. <laughs> okay, you guys, I'm gonna wrap this part up right here. I'm really excited for the next one because our girl is finally gonna become a full on Glaceon. <laughs> Oh my god, her bio dad just walked in, made a face like, ugh, and then walked out. <laughs> Anyways, yeah, so thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please leave a like, comment, subscribe, share the video, and follow me on all my social media. I hope you're as excited as I am to finally move on with her generation, like, outside of this household, get some new scenery, a new house, all of that. I'm very excited. <laughs> I am also very excited to find her a better boyfriend than Mateo because he was just not it. Alright guys, I hope you have an amazing day and I hope I'll see you next time. Bye!